Hey there, it's Kara. Today I'm going to show you how to upload any PDF into the Books app on your iPhone or iPad. To demonstrate, I will be using the free interactive ebook for Gestalt language processors that we have available at SproutedRootsWellness.com. After you add the book to your cart and check out, you'll be taken to a page that has the download link to the PDF. You'll click the download link, which will take you to a new tab and open up the book in your browser. You can view the entire book from this tab by scrolling, but you will not have any interactive features such as these buttons when you navigate through the book. We will need to import the PDF into the Books app by going to the top of your page to the right of the URL bar to this upload icon. Once you select this upload icon, you'll be taken to this menu. You'll want to slide through these apps until you come across the Books app. If you do not see the Books app in your list of applications, you'll have to scroll all the way to the end to the More button. And if the Books app still isn't there, that means you have removed it from your iPad, so you will have to reload it. After you select the Books app, the book will automatically open. And now that you have uploaded the PDF, you should be able to navigate through using these buttons. You can also navigate through the book by swiping left and right. To keep your books and PDFs organized into collections, you can click the top area of the screen and then select the left arrow. And you'll see over here to the left that I have a few different collections that I created to keep my books and PDFs organized. If you wanna create your own collection, you scroll all the way down here to the bottom where it says new collection and you'll select that. I've already created a new collection called Sprouted Roots eBooks that I plan to move this book into. And there are two different ways to move the book into that collection. You can either select the three little dots at the bottom right of the book icon and select add to collection and then select the collection you want to put it into. Or you can long press on the button and drag it into the collection on the left. Please feel free to let me know below in the comments if you have any questions. Have a good day.